sell as gear as possible. I'd rather just ride in a t-shirt. I used to just moto. When I did motos in California in the summer, I just wore a t-shirt to ride with my gear. T-shirt, I always wore a chest plate though. Kind of weird that I lost a kidney with the chest plate on. The handlebars went under my stomach and pushed up under my rib cage, like, and popped, exploded my kidney. Just a very weird deal. It's where the handlebars curve. I should probably be wearing a chest plate when I ride now, but it's so hot. I feel like I just cruise. I almost feel like I should probably wear a neck, neck brace just to be safe. New set of goggles, dude. <laughs> They're a hundred percent. A lot of people probably recognize that half face helmet from the two stroke video. It was the one I wore at X Games in 99 or 2000, that half face. But hundred percent sent me these to wear in the video and they, they came late, so I'll wear them now. They're actually comfortable, they're tiny. Like supposed to be like an old school vintage goggle.
race here at IR. It's a racetrack that Haley's actually, I think, race stock cars at. Or a lot of race car stuff here, but came out to a local dirt bike race, which is always cool. Um, they have a big, I think, money race tonight. So all the privateers over here are trying to make some money, and I remember doing that. When I race pro, we always go to all the money races and go try to win a couple grand here or there to kind of fund the gas and keep going, but uh, it's cool. It's, it's a cool track. It's, dirt's really good, and it's uh, cool to see a big crowd. There's a lot of people here for uh, a local race. So anyway, we got an press day coming up and then the pro national out at Washougal. A lot of moto history up here in the, in the northwest, so it's actually a big militia vibe up in the northwest. Like, besides SoCal, the next biggest spot for militia has been the Pacific Northwest. So, uh, we back everyone up here. There's a different breed of people that, lead, that live up here. You gotta be a little tougher, so it's cool. It's cool for Hayden to come out and hang out and say what's up to everyone uh, that's on the local scene, so that's the deal. Thanks, man. Freestyle? Yeah, dude. Don't mark my word, bro. Someone's gonna get really sketchy, dude. Yeah, this is perfect. If someone gets sketchy, they're coming straight into us, bro. You ever do any of these whip competitions here? No. I can't really whip very big. So. I'm sure Hayden would love to. Maybe a back flip, actually. Backy. You could flip that. For sure.
you think about the ride? It was great. And apparently, Dad. I've never been on live Dad. television before. PIR, local motocross track. They had a money race. We went over there to go check it out. And we're like, all right, we gotta at least do a bet. So the finals, it was um, number 80 versus number 78. They uh, were racing in the money race. So I was like, all right, I'll take number 80. So I said 100 bucks to oh, Aiden. Yeah. <laughs> 100 bucks, whoever wins. Uh, and uh, dude, I thought I had 100 bucks. Uh, I thought I was gonna win. And then the 78 passed them with like 20 laps to go, so. I was like, all right, I'm done, we're out of here. So I just left. And I'm pretty sure that's how it finished. But I was kinda, kinda bummed, dude. I, the number 80 really let me down, dude. I thought he had a little more speed in him, but it's all good. I lost 100 bucks to Hayden at the local race, so we'll get it back. <laughs> mm -hmm. 